It's alive. I don't know why it's bubbling like that. I don't know about that. What's going on, G Body Gang? What's happening? And you already know what time it is, man. We finna get back at the, uh, finna pull these headers in the inside, pull this header wrap in the inside of the house, and we finna get it wrapped, man. We finna get it nice and prepared for this installation. I got the headers back there in the corner, so I'm finna go and pull that box in the inside of the house. Uh, got my gloves. I gotta get my get my bucket of water and we finna get to it you did so let's see what we got man we got that flow tech exhaust so let's go and take this back in but before we get started you already know what you gotta do for your boy you gotta like comment subscribe to the channel definitely smash that notification bell that way you can stay alert to all the new drops you did all right we back so got my water man got my wrap um, haven't quite made up my mind yet whether or not I'm going to use zip ties for the time being just to hold it in place because I'm not putting them on the car right now. Uh, I do have some metal ties in the house. Uh, but I've been hearing some things that the metal, those, these type of metal ties, they don't really work out like, like they supposed to. You know what I mean? So people been saying get some hose clamps, this, that, and the third. And if I put in the order for hose clamps then I'm gonna have to wait so I don't know I tried I used one of them as a what do you call it as a test and it ain't coming back apart I, I done tried so I don't I don't know what they talking about I hate to let all of them go to waste actually you know what I think I'm gonna just use these man you know what I mean I think I'm gonna just use them but anywho so what we finna do now you notice I got my gloves on you did so uh, cause you don't wanna get this stuff on your hands, you feel me? So, uh, um, what I'm gonna end up doing is I'm gonna go ahead and pull this out the box. I'm gonna go ahead and soak this in some water. You said you just want it damp. You don't need to, ooh, I need a mask. I need a mask on my face. I wanna put a mask on my face. Let me go get this mask real quick, y'all. And I'm gonna double up on the gloves. You know what I mean? Just to make sure. They say this stuff make you make you itchy. I'm gonna hit that light for y'all too, man. Yeah, man. So, yeah. So they did say this stuff make you real itchy. Uh, so, I don't wanna take a chance with nothing coming through. It's alive. I don't know why it's bubbling like that. I don't know about that. I'm gonna uh, go ahead and open this up. Um, yeah, so this is the passenger side. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna let that soak just a little bit. Then I'm gonna get a rough estimate on how much, how much I need to go around each tube. Uh, this one should be relatively simple. Just kind of like looking at it. What I'm probably gonna end up doing is I'm probably going to wrap each one of the primaries uh, separately. Actually, I might wrap, 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 and then wrap this one last. So yeah, I'm gonna wrap one, two, three separately. Then wrap this around. Hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna wrap this around to here. And I'm gonna wrap it to about right.
This is weird. So I'm probably gonna wrap it to about like right here. Yeah, probably right here in this band. I'm gonna wrap it and then come back to this one and wrap it singly with that same last roll. That's what I'm gonna end up doing. I went ahead and measured how many loops I needed. And on my first primary, I needed 18. I had to call, I had to call my wife out here, man, so she can help me out. You dig and uh, make markings because I was undercounting, overcounting, and I'm gonna do it one time, one time only, but it's primary too. So we got 18. This is the size of my loop. You did, and uh, I'm gonna go ahead and cut 18 of these, or I'm gonna fold it 18 times, then make my cut, then we're gonna wrap it. Uh, I wanna touch this so bad, actually. Good, I can't, I can't. All right, so if you can see these little line markings that we made all the way up, that's how we did it. You know what I mean? This is my fiber. This stuff is like, it's, it's loose. So it like fibers and stuff are everywhere, man. So I'm trying to be extra careful. But uh, that's what we're going to do, man. So I'm going to go ahead and fold this up. And we're going to go ahead and get started. You did. So let's work. checking in checking in with y'all man so this stuff is it's pretty cool but it's um uh, it ain't the easiest product to work with you did um so just some pointers i'm gonna let y'all see what i got so far i went ahead and wrapped two of the primaries and um uh, turned out pretty clean had to get creative at the top here and kind of, you know, I held off. I got on this one, I got down to here. I kind of held off on wrapping the rest of it because it gets close at the top. Came back with the other one, wrapped it, stopped it, and then take the remaining of this one and wrapped it around the entire both of the tubes. As you can tell, I got two ties on this one, and I'm gonna leave it just like that. I'm gonna leave it just like that. Now, as you can see, all these fibers and stuff. I don't know if you can see all these little fibers sticking up, but uh, yeah, man, this stuff gets, it gets nasty. It gets nasty, so, uh, and it's all over my jacket. So yeah, I see what they're saying as far as making sure you are protected, protected. So actually, I'm gonna put that back in water, man. Let it soak a little bit longer before I do the next one. Um, so with that being said, man, I'm gonna do, I think I'm gonna do this one. This is the longest one. Ooh, no, cause I'm a wrap, final wrap. I'm gonna do this one, the shortest one. I'm gonna start it right here and then I'm gonna start final wrapping it. I'm gonna start right here, start final wrapping it, wrap it, and then reduce it down to three, wrap this one, one good loop, and then go straight into this primary tube here. And then by that point, shoot, I should be able to just keep the whole roll and finish it all the way out. So yeah, that's the game plan, man. Uh, twist ties ain't really that bad. I don't know what people was talking about. I had to get creative with, you know, using this. Well, the instructions say use it. And what you do is at the end, you clip a piece off, 
So I put the piece off. Uh, let me make sure I got that stuff on me. Yeah, clip the piece off and then use this to kind of twist it up and bound it up. As you can see, it's bounded. You can see this stuff is like, it's like fraying a little bit. So I'm going to clean that all up, man, because I want that part to be clean. I don't want nothing, no issues. I'm debating whether or not to put a couple ties down here to hold these in place before I do my final wrap. I mean, it's pretty sturdy, but, uh-oh, got a little tear in my, yeah. So I might, I might actually put a tie down here too before I do like a final wrap to hold these in place. So that's what we got. I'm gonna go ahead and finish this out and I'm gonna come back, show y'all the final product when I'm done, you did, so stay tuned. checking in checking in man had to take a little break real quick man on getting the wrap done on the headers uh, the reason why i took a break man is because i had like a package dropped down uh or sent out to me from ss gang definitely go check my man's out over there man uh and, and i'll have his link in the description and also man uh you can see it you know on a screen wherever i had placed it i ain't gonna be pointing over here and then that joint don't be over there you did so anyways man definitely wanted to show y'all this real quick man uh nice nice shirt man i always appreciate you know what i mean people looking out for other people man it looks like his vendor is finesse tablescapes at gmail.com man so you know what i mean uh nice little car thank you car uh if you definitely want to Holla at them, man, if you want to get some shirts and stuff made, too. Um, but the shirt looks good. It looks really, really good. It matches the SS um, with the red and white and then the gray accent on it. Uh, and it, on the front side, got no flags. Got no flags. So I like this, man. Yeah. Yeah, that's going to be dope, man. Definitely about to, you know what I mean? Show my man some love, slide myself into that, you did, and we're gonna see what's to it, man. But let me go and get back here, man, because I know y'all wanna see how this gonna turn out. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish this up, and then we're gonna go and cut this video, man. Next video to be me putting them things in, you did, and getting that stuff out of the way, you did. So stay tuned. you can see, it turned out pretty good. This is the drop side. So I'm gonna lay this down real quick. But yeah, so the drop side completed. This side completed. So all we gotta do is get this on when you did. So with that being said, man, I'm gonna wrap this thing up, man. I appreciate y'all checking in. You dig and we finna get to work again sooner than later, you did so. Stay tuned and we holler.